Hello colleagues, we present to your attention our research the effectiveness of narrowband phototherapy for psoriasis. Psoriasis is a multifactorial disease with a hereditary predisposition characterized by increased proliferation of epidermal cells, impaired keratinization and inflammatory reduction in the dermis caused by activated leptides, and the synthesis of pro-inflammatory cytokines. Evidence-based uh, pharmacotherapy um, include systematic therapy, preparation, methotrexate, cytoxaparine, biological therapy, acetretin, and external therapy, corticosteroids, etc. Phototherapy. Ultraviolet radiation has an anti-inflammatory and immunomodulatory effect, mainly immunosuppressive. Ultraviolet b rays affect epidermal keratinocytes and lung gas cells. Ultraviolet air rays penetrate deep layers of the skin and affect dermal fibroblasts, the reticles, and the telocytes, and telephotides, mast cells, granulocytes. Objectives. Study the clinical efficacy of narrowband medium wave therapy with a wavelength of uh, 311 nanometer in patients with uh, moderate and severe forms of psoriasis. Methods and materials. <clears throat> 25 patients aged uh, 18 to 55 years with diagnosed psoriasis with stopped course and resistance to standard therapy were under observation. All patients were prescribed uh, narrowband medium wave ultraviolet therapy. Te therapy design. The procedures were performed four times a week using the photobove Dermalite 1000. The initial dose of UVA radiation was prescribed uh, depending on the type of skin. Uh, each procedure, the radiation dose was increased by uh, 0 0.1 dolly uh, for centimeters. With the appearance of weak erythema, the dose was left the same. The course of treatment uh, uh, was 15 uh, to 20 procedures. The treatment was carried out against the background of standard pharmacotherapy. Result design. Psoriasis array and severity index to assess the severity of psoriasis and the effectiveness uh, of the treatment. With the decrease in PACI by uh, 95% of more clinical remission, 70 to 94% significant improvement, 30 to 69% improvement, and 29% and below uh, lack of dynamics regression. The quality of life was assessed uh, using the Dermalite Dermatological Quality Life Index. Monitoring of the safety of the method was carried out according to clinical blood and uh, urine tests. Biochemical blood analysis. <clears throat> the results. Among the observed patients, there were uh, 14 men and 11 women. There were 5 people aged uh, 18 to 29 years, 30 to 49 years, 17 people, uh, over 50 years, 3 people. The duration of the disease acquired uh, up to a year in 4 people. 1 to 3 year in 6 people, 3 to 5 year in 5, and more than 5 year in 10 people. Uh, the second skin uh, phototype according to Fitzpatrick was uh, observed in 4 patients, uh, the third phototype in 19 patients, the fourth in uh, 2 patients. Uh, before treatment psoriasis, is, uh, patients had a moderate form. Passy uh, 26.4 points, topid course and uh, resistance to standard therapy. The patients had a low quality of life, uh, 22.8. Uh, the patients showed marked positive dynamics, passive decreased by uh, 89% from uh, 26 points uh, to 1.2. To 1 so, clinical remission was noted in all patients. According to the dynamics of PACI, the overall uh, therapeutic efficacy of UVF for uh, 311 nanometer therapy averaged uh, 96%. After completion of therapy, DLQI significantly decreased from uh, 22.8 to 8.7 points. After using this uh, method, no side effects were observed. According to the results uh, of clinical blood, urine and biochemical blood tests, 
No significant changes uh, were detected at the end of the course of therapy, which confirms the high safety of the method. The results of long-term observations show that the majority of, of patients with the use of therapy managed to control the process throughout this year. Uh, Pacey was uh, 1.9 points. This image shows uh, treated patients. The first photo is before treatment, the second photo is after treatment. Conclusion The use of ultraviolet B311 nanometer therapy in patients with psoriasis is a highly effective technique. This method allows to edge of clinical remission and significant problem in the vast majority of patients, 96%. With this form of psoriasis, the use of the main causes of the treatment of ultraviolet B311 nanometers allow monitoring the process in 83.3% of patients throughout the year. Thanks for watching. Do you have any question? Write in email.